which normal metallic threats would not be able to handle or satin stitch that wide. They snap or break. This metallic has the elasticity in it that gives it the give so that it can stretch across and even sew through without breaking on this heavy placemat. So this is double layered with the um, stabilizer in the hoop, but then as a placemat, it also has a filler in between. Oh, this is just so, a purchase placemat, so it has a filler? It has a filler in between, so it's okay. very stiff and very heavy, but because of this thread, it does not break. It just sews beautifully through it, even with the satin stitch that wide. Right now, it's um, finishing up its second letter. You have a pre wound bobbin, and it has top stitch 90 needle for this particular um, project and this technique and then we simply have basted the placemat to the stabilizer in the hoop so that we don't have to try to fit that in the hoop. So the basting stitch around the monogram will come out and be removed and it will just yes. only have the right, initials right. in the end. So it gives us just beautiful stitch quality, beautiful density. The sheen on it is amazing. And we're, you slowed the, the speed down just because we're demonstrating here, but... I slowed the speed down because I'm lazy. <laughs> uh, well, right, you, I mean, I would be able to sell this at full speed, but then this would be stitched out in two seconds. Right. And I want people to be able to, to see, see it. how yeah. it forms the stitch. So we've slowed the machine down so you can actually see it take those wide satin stitches right. that in any of the other metallic threads I have that would have it would have broken 50 times right. by now. It looks beautiful. Isn't it's really it gorgeous? The is gorgeous. I think it's beautiful. <laughs> We're working on a Janome Horizon. What's the name of this machine? It's the Janome Horizon Memory Craft 12,000, the latest embroidery sewing machine from Janome, which is their top of the line sewing, embroidery, and quilting machine with 11 inches arm to needle. That's why we're able to That's fit nice. this without yeah. working, any problems. We do have all of our wonderful lighting so we can actually see. We've got a great magnifier so we can even see the stitches being formed up close. So it really does look right, great. Right. Of course, right now my fingerprints are all over <laughs> it so it doesn't look so great. Um, stainless steel plate on the machine which allows for smooth transition mm -hmm. when the hoop is sliding and gliding across. And this monogram comes in this machine. is a built-in monogram on the machine. There are six different alphabet styles, and you can use any of those alphabet styles in the monogram. And so I've selected Doug's monograms to go on here, put them in the corner so he has his own personalized right, placement. placement. So now no one will be able to use it but him. <laughs> this is a gorgeous way to dress up a purchase placement, or you can make your own. Oh my God, this is the easiest way, but what a great gift idea also. Oh, it's, great. it's wedding yeah. season, and you know, you got a lot of people that are moving in, the young kids who are getting married and you know they want nice table linens this is a great gift and a great way to personalize it for them that otherwise you know you take a monogram like this for example Bloomingdale's is $30 a placemat right you know I mean right I think that we probably have 80 sets for $30 if right. we do it ourselves yeah, really. so at this point it's now finished it's we'll finished. remove the hoop and then we'll remove the basting and it'll all come out so on the back you just want to leave everything Look at how gorgeous it is, even on the wow. ground. I mean, that's pretty impressive. Uh, normally, it wouldn't be nearly as nice. There, you'd see a lot of puckering, a lot mm -hmm. of pulling, um, and you'd see a lot of broken threads. So we just clip our basting threads on the front. It allows us to simply remove the basting thread and pull it away. None of the holes stay. They all disappear mm -hmm. back into it. And then you just make sure all the basting threads are removed. Now we've got a gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous beautiful, monogram placement. Beautiful. And this is tearaway stabilizer. Yeah, this is a tearaway, yep. so we just leave it in the hoop. If you leave it in the hoop when you rip it away, it comes out clean. Huh. Oh, leave it in the hoop when you rip it away and it comes out clean. Yes. Good to know. Good tip. Now we'll put something in the other side. That's beautiful. We're gonna we're gonna dress it up a little bit more. I think so. I yeah. think we need to add yeah. a little something in the other corner. Yeah. You know, give it a little something, a little oomph. Right. So we'll just peel away that. All of that stabilizer will just come out. Of course, you can leave it in to wash it, and it'll come out and wash. Oh, that's but true, yeah. we'll just go ahead and get it out and just peel it away. Get rid of all our little jumpers. And we're using Krynek. Let's see, antique gold it's, color. It's one of my favorite colors. I love the antique gold. Um, antique gold is just so elegant. It's so rich. It blends well with most it colors. Does. It's a real pretty um, gold. You know the summer. Some of the different golds are, um, you know, maybe 
for specialty things such as holiday or something like that. But this gold is great for every day. 